Chubb back into the game at running back. Now Mayfield takes a shotgun snap, throws, and he missed Landry, and it's tipped and intercepted by Malcolm Butler. He's going to run it to the 20, to the 15, to the 10, to the 5, and he hits the pylon along the way, and he's in for a pick six touchdown. be talking not about the Browns beating the Steelers, not about two wins in a row, but they'll be talking about that ugly incident that ended the game with eight seconds remaining and a nasty brawl in the end zone to the closed end of the stadium. The nation watched it. It wasn't a pretty ending at all, and you would have to think the punishments will be swift and they will be severe. Where the Browns drop the season finale, 33 to 23 to the Cincinnati Bengals falling to six and 10 on this season and putting a disappointing end on what can only be described as a disappointing season, one that certainly fell short of lofty expectations in the. All right, Sam, moments ago, the Cleveland Browns are going to hire Kevin Stefanski, the Vikings offensive coordinator, as their next head coach. This is a man that last year hauled the Podesta, the Browns chief strategist, pushed to hire. And now it's a matter of him being able to put it together with the Cleveland Browns and quarterback Baker Mayfield.